How are we going? Just out here for a bit of a Friday afternoon trail explore. So where I am, it's a place called Selix Hill in the south of Adelaide. Been hearing about a track out here for a while. And I decided to come along and have a bit of a crack today. So I'm probably a bit over halfway up the climb. Started all the way down at the main road and yeah, it's a fair old climb. Pretty easy grade. It's just long and meandering fire road. And with your suspension locked out to make it easy, you get chucked all over the place, so many little rocks everywhere. But as far as climbs go, pretty easy. So I'm just gonna roll up and have a bit of a look-see. It does appear to be listed as black diamond. And I've had some, a bit of a look at some videos of people riding it. It looks like it might be pretty steep with a fair amount of features. So we're gonna take it pretty easy, but should be able to get a pretty good idea of what it's like. I will try and capture the, the grade as best I can and hit as many features as I feel comfortable with out here on my own. So, yeah, kind of limited in the risks I'll take, but just got to keep your wits about you. How's those views? Crazy rock formation. So I'm guessing the track must start somewhere up there. I did see that it, it came out further down, but it's hard to tell exactly how far. I reckon maybe that ridge line there, but I'll check back in with you at the top. Still going, a bit longer than I thought it was. Seen all kinds of interesting stuff out here. Big pile of wrecked car bodies in a crevasse. Pedaling up, up and up. I'm lucky this bike climbs so well. <laughs> Be prepared if you're going to head out here for a big long climb up. I reckon probably at best today I'll get two runs in. You could easily spend a whole day here riding up and down. But yeah, there's something to take into consideration. We'll see if the juice is worth the squeeze. Alright. So we've gotten to the top of the actual trail and as you can see we've got quite a lot of elevation to lose so one thing i really notice is there's a lot of moisture up here the trail itself seems pretty dry but it could be a bit sketchy so we're going to take it pretty easy and just see what's ahead let's have a sus Slippery grass stuff. Oh god. Getting what it's like. <sighs> Bummer. Oh well. That corner's mega loose. <laughs> Go. 
out of on. Ooh wee! She can definitely pick up some speed out here, I tell you what. Seat smacked me in the neck, is it? I'll learn it better soon. Yeah, yeah. Really good for learning braking this track actually. Gonna be pretty precise. There's an inside line here somewhere, I think. Oh, it's pretty tight. That's it. Don't mind me riding the brakes the whole way down, but just for my own safety. Because it's it's really hard to know what's coming. And the moment you let go of the brakes, you take off like a rocket. But yeah, it's actually pretty good. That's a lot of fun. Might go up and do a full run. Um, and maybe hit some more of those jumps, maybe not, not sure yet. Um, yeah, Let's see how we go. There's a couple of drops in there though that like do, do not roll them because I bottomed out my, even my bottom bracket or my chain ring of something in there. Chain ring seems okay. Yeah, certainly gave something a hiding. <laughs> But yeah, come and give it a crack. I won't leave directions as to how to get here because I'm not too sure on the legality of it all. But I've seen plenty of others riding it, so I don't know. I would assume it's okay as long as you're not just being a muppet. But yeah, if you can find it, it's worth a crack.